cloud is a bunch of computer servers, but instead of being in your server room, they're somewhere else. Someone else manages them. You just get to use the services provided from them. You know, like Google, Amazon. You buy their services, you can use their compute cloud, their compute storage, whatever. Alternatively, you could build a private cloud. Private cloud gives you the same uh, function and services that a public cloud would, but you, the organization, you own the whole thing. That's your equipment. No one else can use it unless you choose to lease it out or whatever. The last thing I'll say there, I said uh, compute and storage. Uh, that's kind of the fuzzy line of clouds and kind of where it leads into hybrid. Compute clouds make a lot of sense. It's a great idea to put your web server up there and it's just always up and everything's great. Putting your storage in a public cloud can get quite costly at times. The bandwidth, the the download rates, the upload rates. So sometimes people will run have their own kind of private cloud on site and it hybrid talks to the cloud and moves data around and maybe your web servers are up on Amazon but it communicates with your cloud on site and well that's kind of the public, the private and the hybrid all rolled into one.